we are going to start by putting one entire cube squash on a tray. I'm also adding a bunch of shishito peppers and one sweet onion. I used shishito peppers because I had them on hand. That was the only reason. You can use regular multicolored peppers. That would be my normal guess. Now I'm putting cumin, salt, and pepper and garlic powder all over this. Be generous. It's okay to add a lot of flavor. You can learn how to cube butternut squash by clicking the link above or at the end of this video, I'll give you a link there also. We are gonna put this in an oven of 425 for about 30 to 45 minutes. Keep checking it and toss it. Now onto our beans. We're gonna season our beans the exact same way. We're not gonna put them in the oven till the last five minutes to warm them up, or you can just put them on the stove. You don't have to combine them all together. That's up to you. While our butternut squash is cooking, let's make our salad. This is one sweet onion that I'm chopping up, and this salad is gonna go on your taco. It's gonna be so tasty. And I have some tomatoes here. I'm cutting up three tomatoes, and we are going to chop these, not real fine, because it just takes too much work, uh, but we're gonna chop them up. Then we're gonna use two avocados, and you can adjust this. You can use more tomato, more onion, more avocado, whatever you want. We're gonna cube these, and we're gonna put these into the salad also. Yeah, I'm getting my hands messy here. That's all right. I'm gonna chop this cilantro. I was just trying to get the big pieces off. Chop this up. We're gonna put it in the salad also. Then we are gonna dress our salad with lime. Now, I used like one whole lime here. It matters how much juice it produces. So, you know, just keep trying it to see how much lime you like. And we're also gonna put salt and pepper. You could, if you want, add a little olive oil too at this point. And stir it all up. Get all those onion pieces all stirred up, and then we're gonna let that sit a while and all the flavors blend together. You can make this ahead of time. Always heat your tortillas ahead of time. These are corn tortillas. I wouldn't use anything less. I have a video on how to properly heat a corn tortilla. We add our salad on top of our squash and bean mixture, and then I have some amazing fresh queso that I'm putting on top of that. You can use regular cheese or no cheese at all. It is still gonna be so good. I'm also serving it with a kale salad, and I also serve limes on the side and cilantro. I hope you enjoyed this amazing meal. Please click on my face to subscribe. I would love for you to subscribe, and also watch these videos I have for you. Thanks. Come back.